So uh, Sarah, like I think a 71 minute first half and then 2.30 at the finish. How do you feel about that? Oh, not good. Um, it's pretty tough out there. Not, not quite what I dreamed for. So, uh, yeah, I think we'll have to, like, I haven't debriefed with Ryan yet. Figure out what went wrong out there for sure. Um, I mean, I'm sure when you finished, you heard a woman ran 209.56. I just heard that. Like, what, what, <laughs> what, what comes to your mind when you hear that? I have no idea. To me, that was really tough conditions out there. Like, it was really sticky and, yeah, most people felt that way. So I can't even imagine running that in that condition. That, that blows my mind. <laughs> so it felt a little warm for you? It seemed... I mean, yeah, just like really humid. And, yeah. I mean, not like cool enough for that humidity to like be, but yeah, it was not like ideal. Not like the last couple of years out here for sure. And where do you go from here? We'll see. Um, yeah, we had some ideas going in, but um, definitely felt pretty tired this build up. So I think uh, at some point, like a, a big break. But um, I think I'm really excited, even though this race didn't go how I wanted to, just like how my body handled the training. So I'm really excited for the next build up to like be able to keep being aggressive and uh, keep, yeah, keep improving in the sport. But yeah, I don't feel like this is a great indicator of of the work put in, but I think like it'll build into the next one for sure. <laughs> Alright, we'll keep it up. Good luck. Thanks.